good morning. Well, it's morning for me, so so good morning. Um, as you can see, I have started painting this. I was working on uh, testing out the clays and working on the little figure, and um, I needed a change of pace, and so, um, yeah, I painted this one black, and then I started going in with some dry brushing um, just to see if I was right about the texture from that little drill bit that I mentioned before, and um, I'm really happy with how this looks, the dry brushing. I don't know how it comes off on camera, but in person it has this really cool, like, delicate, spider-webby kind of look to it that um, that I really dig. And so, um, yeah, I'm just working my way up the figure. Um, you can see this is, you know, where it's still just black. Um, I'm not sure if I'll do the dry brushing on, on the figure itself or leave that for all the swoopy parts and maybe do like a more of like a delicate airbrush kind of a treatment on the figure and see see how it works out um and i you know i might add some colors i i don't know exactly what's all gonna happen i'm just gonna make it up as i go along and keep on going until until it looks cool enough that it looks finished um but yeah that is what's going on at the moment it's kind of a the dry brushing part is kind of a slow process because I want to be really delicate with it so I don't put too much paint on at once and since I'm using acrylic um, it's really easy to have um, like directional lines from my brush strokes show up and I really want to avoid anything like that so um, after a while of using the the brush um, I guess like the it starts to just get sticky and gummy and the paint doesn't go on as well. So then I have to wash the brush, but then I can't use that brush again until it's completely bone dry. Um, otherwise, it just doesn't give the right effect. Um, and I guess honestly what I should do is just go out and get a couple more of the same brush so that one of them can always be dry. Um, but as it is now, after I wash it, I'm just kind of, you know, working on other things and waiting for the brush to dry before I go back in and do more. Um, though, you know, maybe today, when I'm going through that process, um, I could, uh, I could wash the brush with, uh, with isopropyl alcohol instead of water. That would probably flash off a lot faster. So, we'll see. But, um, but yeah, so that's pretty much what is happening right now and as usual I cannot get far enough away from it to fit the whole thing into frame and still be able to rotate it maybe yep. so it won't look like this for long but here it is for the moment 